supersedes a lot of things, including the relationship they have with themselves. In fact, money is their identity. What do you say to those people? What, what are you asking when you ask me, what do I say to them? I'm curious. I'm curious if one of them, if one, if you're working with one of them. Well, what, it isn't about me saying something to them. I answer the question. What do they want to know? Right? So once again, you see Mo, and I'm not picking on you, Mo. But listen, I love it. Keep going. No, you know what's going on here? Do you see? Do you see? You are providing a wonderful display and examination of just how conditioned human beings have become. Because the real, the, 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 the foundational question is so given that it isn't even mentioned. The foundational question is setting someone straight. How do you make them uh, not feel that way? How do you correct and fix their view? How do you make them feel better? You didn't even ask that, but you don't have to. That's you ask the next level up, assuming that that because that's a given, mm -hmm. right? So when you asked me, what would you tell the guy who has who's, you know who's attached, basically attached to money? That's what you're asking. Okay, you wanted me to fix the guy to make him unattached to money, right? And the reason that you believe that is because you believe in shoulds and prescriptions. You believe that he shouldn't be attached to money, and that's because you believe in good and bad. Do you see? Do you see the layer? I see the it foundation of layers. You know, I would say if someone's attached to money, what's the problem? If someone's a heathen, what's the problem? Now, if the person says to me, I have a massive problem. This is eating me alive. I genuinely want to weigh out. Different conversation. Mm -hmm. Different conversation. But we live in a society where the motivational speaker and the priest and the and the, and the mindfulness expert. And, and it's a quicker fix. Right. What they're doing is they, they throw confetti on people, right? Oh, you're, you're sad? Here's a good way to not be sad anymore. Let me give you a hack, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Sure. And that person needs to get in the face with a sledgehammer because he is the one spreading the coronavirus. The coronavirus is not about coronavirus. There's a far bigger coronavirus, and that's called prescription. That's, that's Ebola times a thousand. Coronavirus is small. Well, I mean, it, it, obviously, that type of person has to have a willingness 